What is going on everyone? It's Uzo here and today we are doing something, a couple new things. Uh, one thing, we are going to be trying out the new Kerning Tower uh, content. And number two, we are going to be turning on background music because, you know, it's about time I've listened to what's going on in game. Oh, that good old Kerning City music. Um, and we'll leave sound effects pretty low. Let's turn up the background music. Uh, not too much. That seems like a good spot. All right, so let's go ahead and start it, this up. This is the new content that was released most recently. Um, Kerning Tower, which was before Kerning Square, um, was revamped a little bit. And let's go to, there we go. Oh, music changes a little bit. I, I can't quite remember if this is the same music they used for Kerning Square but it, it has some sort of familiarity with it. It's been gone for a while, so, you know. Oh, good old cutscenes. Blake. And it looks like since then, everybody has gotten a bit of a promotion. Blake, I believe, was a janitor in Kerning Square, and it looks like he's moved on up to uh, something more important. Do I, can I just take the elevator? Oh. Let's see. Oh, this is the music I remember. Okay. This is bringing back some memories. All right, all right. So Blake ended up becoming famous. Okay, okay. Fifty of Blake's new album, seventh and eighth floor. Let's see. Oh, oh, good old CDs. So, for people who have been around long enough, this was one of the premier training maps. At around level thirty, um, they've upped the level quite a bit since then. Let's drop some of these service tooth trick skulls. Um. But, I mean, you could grind here from 33 to, like, 60 or something like that. Like, it was a very wide range of training levels. Um, but it looks like they are, they've done a little bit of a revamp here. I think I can hit both platforms here. Although I can't hit it with an infernal concussion, it looks like. But I can... See if we can get a little bit of a rhythm going here. Looks like I don't need to really go up unless I need to loot. Um, but yeah, uh, these monsters are giving about 9,000. It's 100% burning, so it doesn't look like many people are training here. But they seem fairly easy to kill. Um, you know, a couple hits with a lash. And they're dead. I was actually training at um, Bane's over the map left of the Zakum entrance. And that is my premier training map for levels 130 to maybe about 150. Um, but I wanted to try out Kerning Square and see what this is all about in terms of uh, how much better it might be in terms of leveling. Let's see if I can get a... There we go. And it looks like it's comparable. They, I was getting about 18,000 there um, per kill. But those that's a Star Force map. And these are about 9,000. But these are one shot. The other ones were two shot. So, we might have ourselves a new training map. And since this is the first one, there might be... Let me check the mini-map. I think there are Star Force maps here, but I'm not exactly sure. Uh, maybe not. Um, but, hopefully, the other monsters will give us better EXP. Looks like we're about halfway done with this quest. Let's speed it up a little bit.
two. Skip this one. I think that's it. All right, let's head on back to the quest giver, Enin. Enin. Wow, that actually gave quite a bit of EXP there. <clears throat> So it looks like this is a flashback of Blake when he was at his peak of stardom. All right. So it looks like he might have been reminiscing in the old days. I don't think Blake is all right, but uh. I'm not jumping around so much. Okay, so it looks like they want a casting manager. Talent search. Okay, so I'm guessing I'm gonna have to talk to a lot of people and see who's the most talented out of the bunch. Um, it's interesting. Can I? I'm not sure where exactly I'm supposed to go. Ground floor is that here? That's his office. So ground floor should be here. Oh, looks like another cutscene. Wow, you have all these people. Jackpot Entertainment, nice. 